All right, chapter three, let's go. Hey, do you think that maybe I can, you know, get started here? Okay, so we are going to do chapter three of the mimic, and I've got some help with me. I've got two two four four six FBBMH and JJ Cat one zero one. We're going to help me to play this. So we're going to come in here and do. Come on in. Come on. Come on. Come on. Special guest is <laughs> shy. All right, so the start is at Mukdik, or however you say it. You gotta follow this path through the water. It's clearly laid out, but and you've gotta run the thing, and you've got a lantern. Although you don't need the lantern at this point, and you don't need to worry about running right now because there's nothing dangerous in the water. <clears throat> How do I know this? Because I have tried to. I, yesterday I tried doing this chapter uh, for the original video. So I know a little bit about it, and I did, after the video, I did play it a bit more to try and right, figure out how to get farther in the uh, third chapter. Well, I'm being teleported. Mr. Impatient. Well, I didn't, I didn't know going down there. I was just going to sit there. Yep, you got to go down the hole. I was just going to sit there waiting for you guys. All right, so here... And Mr. Impatient, would you hold on a second? Yes. All right, then slow down. So at the uh, at different places in the game, you get to see um, parts of the story of the girl and the witch, and this is one part. You're gonna have to pause if you want to read it because we're just gonna carry on. I'm not gonna read the whole darn thing. <clears throat> Okay, so first, I'm going to go this way, they are going to go that way, that's fine. And... Can't open this door yet. Interesting, okay. I found the door. Dude, shut up! Jasmine, you ca need to come join us. <laughs> so, off in that direction, if you go over there, is the code for the next door that we have to go through. Yeah, and there's a jump scare over here. Did you see that, Jasmine? No. Oh, sorry. JJ Cat. Alright, so in order to do that, I already know the code. And so I'm going to type in 3, 0, 1, 5. And that opens that one. And you really just need the crowbar. Eh, missed it. coming. JJ Cat, come on. Did you get lost, JJ? No. <laughs> JJ Cat doesn't know this game. Jump scare time! Ready? And here's another part of the story. Go ahead and pause if you want to read it. It's behind us. Ah! That was so scary! Yeah. It was that giant man, woman, whatever it was. Scared me. <clears throat> All right, and again, off in that direction is the code, but we know the code already. 
8749 or 8759, one or the other. So we'll just skip all the excess stuff and go straight to. Whoa, there it was again. It really does look like a uh, male. And you do have to unequip anything that you are holding in your hands when you want to do these codes. Alright. That wasn't too bad, right? Just some jump scares, right? No big deal, alright? This part is the hard part. Well, first of all, you have to stay in the light because generally speaking, if you're in the light, the monster that is running through the water here won't kill you. But sometimes it will. So you want to try to look around before you um, proceed because if you're in the darkness, it will definitely and without a doubt kill you and send you back to the start. We're going to where that dim light is over there because the blade that we need to put on the shrine is over there. Anybody see it? Hopefully it's not going to get me. Alright, so I'm going to actually... Okay, it's over oh, there. I see. It's over by the house right now. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to just get ready and go. And running straight into the house because the safe the safest place is the house. Okay, and you need to solve this very, very simple, basic puzzle by turning these little, whatever my digger call it, thingies to cause the whole thing to connect to form this Japanese character, which I don't know what it means. We need to get the blade. When we get to the blade, the, then we have to go back over this way. And I don't use the lamp when I'm out here because I'm afraid that it will attract the monster's attention. I don't really know if it makes any difference or not. I just know that that's my theory. <laughs> Alright, so we're doing good so far. I don't see the monster anywhere. Wait. Don't really have to worry about the right hand side because that's a border of the map. I'm going to go ahead and run over here. And basically once you're out here, once you've gotten far enough, there's really nothing you can do to save yourself. I can see it. I can see it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, that's where I've got to go over there, the shrine. And that's the monster that will catch and kill us if I don't do this right. I want to know where that thing is going, though. Oops, nope. He's going back toward the shrine, so... Where'd he go? Uh, still going, he's coming back. Coming back where? We're trying, we're trying. This is not as easy as we're making it look because I have the experience of having done this already. There he is. He's trying to oh he's just he's went right by me. Oh, that was so nice. Now where is oh there it is. Oh, darn it! I didn't realize he was behind me. Ah, oh, that sucks. If you get to the shrine and put the uh, the blade in it, let me know. I just got squished like a bug. You know what? I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try going to the uh, to the cave. I find I, my theory is is that if you stand close to, uh, behind, if oh. you stand behind the lantern, keeping the lantern between you and the monster, it may not kill you. Boy, it's really busy over there. Really busy attacking you guys. Well. I'm almost to the cave. On 
honestly, um, when I played this yesterday for the first time, um, some of the jump scares did actually make me jump. And well, the first time it happened that I actually jumped, my, I jumped and it made my son jump, which is kind of amusing to think about it. Alright, so I am at the gate. If one of you, oh, and here's the next part of the story. I think I actually missed showing you part three. <clears throat> um, if one of you manages to put, to put the blade in, I can teleport us out. So that's one thing about this game is if you actually get through a teleport point or get to a teleport point, um, not like the elevators, not the elevators in the hotel uh, in chapter two, but um, a regular teleport point where it takes you to a new map, then everybody that's with you will also be teleported no matter where they are on the map. Yeah, you have to. You have to um, wait until the monster's clearly far away and then make a mad dash. Where are you going, JJ? Okay, pick, take out the blade and put it in there. All right, now I should be able to teleport all of us out. Yeah, I teleported out. some parts of this game, the monster is um, slightly faster than you. In other parts of the game, the monster is extremely fast compared to you. I'm waiting for JJ Cat and uh, 244 to uh, pass through the portal, which I thought was going to tell us. Still searching for your friends, or just are you just trying to survive? Says the monster. 
monster. The red writing, by the way, is the monster. The white writing is your character. And there's no way to avoid going into that hole, so just enjoy. And just try to avoid being hit by these hands. get far enough then the hands can't get ya. I'm safe. I'm safe. Where are you guys? Did you get hurt by the hands? It's really actually very easy. I know that looks difficult but once you get the timing of the first hand, as long as you run, you can make it through. There's really no real challenge to this hallway as difficult as it may look. <clears throat> Those are the arms of the witch. I'm trying to catch you. Ah. Well, I see my arm. Um, two, two, four, four, six. But where is JJ? Cat? Oh, you're not supposed to touch him. <laughs> JJ Cat was running so uh, agilely that she ran right into the arm. That was laying in front of her. My guess is with this story, with the way it's going um, so far, is that um, the a witch imprisoned the moon. <clears throat> um, and now the mimic, which is a demonic force, is trying to trick you into freeing it. Um, which, that's, you know, that's my guess. Or maybe the kid that saw the mimic and the kid died and the saw was enraged. Careful. You should just run. Just run, 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 run. Don't you have run, Jasmine? How do you run? It's just a, a run. All right, step through um, into the next um, area. Um, 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 um. Oh wow! In the tree, do you see that? I, miss, um. <clears throat> I forgot about that thing. Okay, so basically, what you gotta do is you gotta find a soul. Uh, the butterflies in this game are souls, and this butterfly happens to be up. Grab it. Hey, come on. Come on. Why not close you have enough? To, Papa, take out your oh, that's right. I forgot. You can't do two things with your hands at the same time. <clears throat> and I don't know why the spirit is laughing. Uh, JJ, come on. 
Come on, JJ. Don't be afraid. It's just a tall tree. It's not going to hurt you. I want another one. Uh, the door. The door. Yeah, I know. Oh, wow. Three items that we have to find. Well, um, after, well there's the key. Oh, the Papa, there's another paper over here. Yeah. Okay. So if anybody wants to read that, go ahead and pause. And uh, then you got to get the key out of the drawer. <clears throat> and um, there are different things in these rooms, but basically you're looking for three things. A sword, which I think is in this room, behind the yeah, it's behind the um, the divider. You take the sword, and then the there is a rose, and there is a butterfly. That's just the bathroom. It's not useful. The butterfly's here between the two beds. I can hear it. There we go. And then, once you have the butterfly, <clears throat> oh, that's right. It's downstairs. Oh, uh, I just heard something from that door. Don't worry. Go downstairs. Did you hear that too? Don't worry. And offer a rose, a blade, and a corrupted soul. And you need this key. What was sitting there? It's a monster. There's a monster. Oh, okay. And once you... Okay, so I'm going to put the blade in. And this is kind of tricky. You have to get the right angle so that it'll put it in. Oh, I got it. I got okay. it. Okay. And then the corrupted soul goes here. And then we just need to use the key to get the rose which is upstairs. Irritating how the lights are off, but that's okay. <clears throat> and this is a cutscene. We have no control. I don't know why it's cutting into this. It seems kind of a waste. <clears throat> in here and get the rose and there it is right there I'll show you or not survive? because it's magic ah yeah. oh, 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 the jump scare got you go get the rose Jasmine and we'll let Jasmine put the rose on the set the uh, <clears throat> display Downstairs to the set, um, the ritual room. It's so peaceful in this little garden back here. Yeah, yeah, Alright, thanks, Rose. Try clicking and moving closer. It's kind of difficult. Kind of an awkward thing. This is, um, <coughs> this, uh, chapter. Sure, man. What? I'm trying to help. Oh, there you go. Uh, In this chapter, placing things is a little bit awkward. You have to be at exactly the right place. Um, oh, I'm sorry. We have to go out through the portal now. Portal's over here, guys. 
Boing. Um, ready? Oh. oh What's first, wrong? The first judgment. <laughs> um, there's two ways. Yeah. Okay, this is dead end, so go the other way. This way. Oh. What's that? Come on. Go ahead. Go. Oh, there's something down there. Yeah, go ahead, guys. It won't hurt you. Uh -huh. it, it's just a jump scare. Go. <gasps> See? It didn't hurt. It was supposed to be scary, but it wasn't. And on we go. Okay, now this is the hard part. This is where I eventually gave up. There are four hands and there are four skulls. You have to find all the skulls. And there is a monster patrolling that will chase you and try to get you. So I know where three of them are. Two are to the right here, which I'm going to try to get one and bring it back. And two are to the left. Okay, I found the white skull already. Hopefully I can make it back without being killed. Um, okay, so red, white, gray, and black. Okay. Um, what's this doing? Alright, so I've got the white skull. I'm going to place it in. There's something behind these doors. This That's door. where we came from. Okay. Alright, the white skull is in there. And something is laughing. So you guys need to help me here. I've gotten the right the um, the white skull. I'm gonna go get the. I think it's not the black skull. I forget which skull it is. Black, uh, the gray white, one. Black and gray. All right, go to the left. I'll go to the right. I think this is the way I went before. Yep. She was to the left, Papa. Who? She killed Jasmine. No, well, that doesn't mean anything. She moves fast. Down There's down. the red skull. Oh no, she's chasing me. She got me. I had the red skull and she got me. To the left ish. Hi. Hi. I saw the rose. I'll keep it. Alright, you keep it. I lost everything. I don't remember exactly how to get there, but it's off in this direction. Oh, darn it, she got me again. Take the risk of losing the rose, kiddo. I don't care. We need those skulls. The hardest to one to find is the black one. It's so hard to see it. Right, because it's in the shadows. Well, let's look for the easy ones, uh -oh. red and gray. Uh oh, I hope she's not going to come after me right now. I'll well, keep trying. Uh, she's coming. She was coming. Ah! Got me again! Dang it! You guys gotta keep trying. Just risk it, you reggae. Uh, uh. I found the black skull. All right, all right, that's good. That's good. As long as I can actually escape. Oh gosh, she's in front of me. 
She got Jasmine very fast. Well, the good news is that because she got Jasmine, she didn't get me. <laughs> run, 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 run. So I've never actually, this is the first time finding the black skull, and now I don't remember where the gray skull is. Last time we found the hard skulls. <laughs> All right. Stop laughing, okay? Hey, you, no hey, you have to take the risk of losing no. that extra item. Come on. Stop running away. Just go find it. <laughs> oh, fudge. Well, you're safe for a moment, Jasmine. Ooh. Ooh. It got I you. Away. It I got away. Hey, stop running. Go find it. No, she's... She's gonna kill me if I kept on going. It's too fast. Oops. Run back, run back, run back, run back. <clears throat> Go take a look. I'm trying to restore my hit run. Okay. See, this is. I, I tried this several times and I just eventually I was she's like. Coming, she's coming. <clears throat> I was just so frustrated I gave up. You let her away for you, from you, so. Hopefully. I found the gray skull. Okay. <clears throat> Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Come here. You got the gray skull. All we gotta do now is get the red skull. Come on. There we go. You don't have to click to put those in. Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Come on. You know what? I gotta back up and restore my run. <coughs> in a corner oh. in a big room. Probably this must be the way to be the steam of the red skull. No. You need to actually help. I was. No. The red skull. I was just looking at the uh what color it was. Hello. Red. <laughs> it's red. Hello. Okay. It's this uh, way. The you got it? Okay, I'm distracting her with being in the wrong area. Well, Hopefully. Cool. Okay, this way, this way, this way. Yeah, go, go, you're getting out. <laughs> oh, jeez Louise, you had it too. Why were you just not running? You had it. Ooh, she almost got me. Oh, I was all out of run. Run juice. It's pretty juicy. Yeah, she's very fast. Ooh. I've got it. Sacrifice yourself for me. I've got it. I've got it. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Oh, it's gone. Alright, here we go. The last... Let's go. Oh, there it is. It's open. <clears throat> Stop laughing. No one likes your laughing. Nothing's funny. Except maybe that. All right. So this is the farthest I've ever gotten. Well, now I'm, I'm beyond that point, I should say. Hey, we're back. And we're back. Oh, and, and the TV's ready. Can I fix you? I don't care about the TV. Are we looking for something? Aha! This, this is... Wait. Oh, I think there's a piece of this... No. There's, it seems like there's wait. a piece of the story in here before. Or in one of the other rooms, maybe. I don't know. Um, we're upstairs now. Papa. Yeah, this is where we started last time. No, no, no. We're upstairs, not downstairs. See? We're downstairs. Okay, alright. 
Whatever you want to believe, you go ahead and believe it. Um, <laughs> this nope, is. I I'm not sure what to do now. Although it is very dark outside, instead of being lighted as it was previously. <laughs> Look around. I don't know what to do now. Nothing in the bathroom. The soul, the black butterfly is gone. There's nothing to see outside. Okay, we've got a, a room. We've got a room check out, guys. We can, we can have fun here. We leave. Ooh, all nope. right, I'm leaving. Can't do anything in here. <clears throat> okay, um, downstairs we go then, where the monster probably is. Are you scared? No, just saying. Oh, yep, the monster's down here. Sitting in a dead kind of pose. Where? See? Can you see it? Oh, yeah. The male one? Yes. Or semi male one? We have to go. I think we need to go this way. Okay. Is that or, me? or just be scared by. Guys. Yeah. You went in there and. Oh, it's dead. And it has a key. I wonder what killed it. Did someone survive and manage to kill a monster? Whoa. <clears throat> wow. Someone actually did that? And there's nothing in here anymore. Maybe that was just one of the victims. No, it was a monster member from the river. I know, but maybe it was actually a victim that was doing what the mimic wanted it to do. Nice picture. I think that's actually a famous painting, but I'm not sure. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, don't appro Oh, look at the blood coming out of the eyeballs yeah. of that one. Different from the others. Now, now JJ is in the lead. Mm. Oh, wait. Mm, we're all racing to go to the lead. I'm in the lead. Nope, J J oh, wow, a nice jump scare. Thank you. Uh, okay. <laughs> was that supposed to scare me? Well, there are... You know, I think, uh, you never... Hey, back. Well, either it's a loop or it's a duplicate, um... Yes. Those are, um, Japanese signals to, um, prevent the passage of evil spirits. But obviously, they don't work. Huh? We're here again? What? Oh, is, this, is this the end? Uh, no, 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 it can't be the end. We must have missed something. Maybe we could go to the one of the paintings. Yeah. Maybe that bloody painting is it. Maybe it's one of these um, candles. All right, I'll go back toward the room and try all of the candles. How exciting! I don't know. I don't know what to do. Or we're just like grasping at straws. Stay tuned. None of them work. Oh wait, wait. What? I can't see what's on your screen. Alright, well let's look carefully then. said so. Oh, no. We just went back. We just go back. I see. Bye-bye. What? Look. 
We're in a new area. So we're going ah. back and forth and back. Back in the watery grave. I'm going this way. Just because I'm a rebel. Um, there's big, big butt hands. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's a hand. Okay. Well, I'm not going to walk into the hand. I'll walk on top of this one, though. Because, you know. to this red Well, I found an exit. I just don't know how to use it. Interact with the skulls on the pillars in order to open this door. I'm hurt bad. Okay. Interact with the skulls on the pillars. Find the pillars. Interact with the skulls. I don't know what to do. Oh dear. It's just running around, isn't it? Yeah, it hurt me pretty bad. I'm not yellow. Me too. Oh, okay. Um, uh, I found the red one of the pillars. Changing the skulls on it to green. No! Get away from me, Owie. I'm almost dead. I found the exit. We don't need the exit, we need to do the pillars. Flip the skulls. I'm almost dead. Oh, darn it, I'm dead. It finally succeeded in. Does it jump me. scare you? No, it just okay. runs out of the dark, and you know, if you don't get out of its way, it wishes you like a bug. <clears throat> Look on those. Yeah. Green, 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 green. Uh, Alright, we gotta find the rest of them. I don't know how many pillars there are. another pillar but it killed me before I could get to it why are you saying that why are you hiding over here you're not helping hiding I Stay near the walls. <clears throat> and if you're near it, stay inside the skull. Aha, I see another pillar. Right 
by me. Oh, 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 don't kill me, don't kill me. Is anybody near the door? Yes. Can you tell me? I think there are more pillars, but I'll look. Yeah, I don't know where there are any other pillars. So try clicking on the door if you get to it. I already did that. After I did the last pillar? I think. Increasing. Yeah, it doesn't increase. Alright, well, I'm gonna look for another pillar. Me too. I thought I got them all. This is confusing. Right next to the skull. I'm in the skull. Now. Maybe we miss a skull on a pillar, so they look like they're all done, but one of the pillars. Good idea. Double check all the pillars. Japanese writing on my screen means you're almost dead. I'm gonna get you. Maybe there's a pattern that we have to establish when we do the first one. Yeah. I just didn't understand the way you were saying it. I wish there's another 
another map for this. That was a clue. Clue be useful. I've tried different patterns. I need to just try one skull at a time and see if that changes it. Why are you just sitting here? Uh, hi. Yeah, I... <clears throat> I don't know. Can you look it up? <clears throat> I don't know what the... Um, Chapter three, three pillars. Dead. Thank you. Oh, oh! I got one of the the pillars to work. How? I I don't know. I got killed right after as I did it. <clears throat> one of the pillars is green, so we have to fiddle. Around. I think it was three green, one red. I saw. Well, I'm at it right now. I see one, two greens. Red and it's um opposites. Reds and gr reds and greens opposites. Just had to figure that out again on the other ones. Nope, I'm not feeling Yeah, I'm just It just likes you. It's kind of like a home there. It likes you. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, 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 oh. Multiple times we've gone there and it's just camping there. It ever, very rarely ever goes out to attack. Well, other I have to say I disagree with you. I just saw it. No, that didn't work. Maybe there's more than one of those spiders. Come on, oh, why isn't this working now? No okay, so different ones have different combinations. This sucks. Uh, no, 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 don't kill me. Oh, man. <gasps> I 
I did, got another one. One pillar left. The light is green at the door? Mm -hmm. Good. I'm at the last pillar. Well, almost. <clears throat> so it's just kind of random. Oh, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me! Don't... Why did you take so long to pass that time? Oh, boy. Ah! There's one. You found another one? Nope. Well, I'll let you do it. Since... Two of us working on it at the same time isn't going to work. No, I just saw that. Ah! It's guarding it. <laughs> it keeps on going around. Yeah, well, if this is real life, we are now. <sighs> Interesting. The faces of the different monsters, like you said. These are my puppets, your fellow ancestors who binded you to this curse. Chapter 3 completed! Something feels off. Was this all even real? Am I really home now? End of chapter 3. So, we have completed the first three chapters of the game. There is nightmare mode, but I don't really see a point in doing nightmare mode. It's just going to be more frustrating than this was to do. Um, so, basically, you just got to be patient and persevere. Push through, find objects, get through mazes without being killed. <clears throat> and complete tasks and, and you'll make it through. I think that this is uh, compared to some other games I've played like SCP. What's that one that uh, the first SCP game I played? The, 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 the security breach or something like that? Uh, SCP containment breach. That was a really hard one. I, I eventually gave up on that one. <laughs> because it's just so frustrating. But this is not too bad. I wish at the end there were a way to get out. And it did say in the lobby that there will be upcoming chapters and chapter 4 is in the works. <clears throat> so maybe in the future I'll be doing more videos of this. But for now, that's all for me. Thank you very much for watching and please be a kind gamer.